funny how I'm going to summer party and outside it's cloudy as... Hello everyone, welcome back to my YouTube channel. I do look quite fancy today um, because I just filmed a get ready with me video for a summer party and that was last week's video. Go check that out if you are into this face. Everyone is kidding. So I've done my makeup, put my dress on. Now I'm quickly gonna show you what's in my tiny bag for tonight. I really love this because it's got different textures. So it's got a suede front with kind of like cinching in and then it's got a for obviously faux crocodile leather um, for the clasp with gold detailing and then the back is just faux leather and I just love it and this was from Dorothy Perkins I got this as a present from my grandma a few years back I think it might be three years ago now so I've had this for quite a while but I love it very much and it's tiny and whenever I have to use tiny handbags I freak out because I don't know what I'm gonna limit myself to but I think I've done a good job tonight so I'm gonna tell you what there is I love this because it comes with a also comes with a zip very safe good um, yeah, so I'm just going to empty it. It's basically one compartment and then it's got the usual zip compartment at the back. And I'm going to start with, actually I'm going to start with that. And in there, I usually put my makeup products because it's not big enough to take a makeup bag. Um, so I just... I just put them in there. I only put three in here. And the first is the Maybelline The Eraser Eye, which is my favorite concealer at the moment, not just for under eyes, but also to cover up any spots or redness that I do not manage to cover up with my foundation. So I take this for touch-ups, basically. And then I also take the mascara that I've used, and. For this look, I've used the L'Oreal Mega Volume Miss Hippie Mascara. Um, so I put that in there. And the lipstick, of course, which for this look, it's the Sleek Matte Me Ultra Smooth Matte Lip Cream in the shade. I'm not sure I'm going to say this right. Rio Red. And then I also put a few bobby pins in there because when your hair is not just loose and down and you've got so many pins in there you just need some spare ones and then of course something that has to be in your handbag every time it's the powder that you've used and in my case it's the Rural London Stay Matte Powder and a tiny brush, powder brush that I keep specifically to go in handbags because it's just tiny and quite handy. So now I'm just gonna pick out things, no particular order. The first thing is a notebook because everyone needs a notebook in a summer party and on a night out. I'm just crazy. I just basically like keeping a very tiny notebook with me because I'm on the train, ideas come up and it's just so much easier to have a notebook and jot them down rather than try to remember them. I don't like jotting them down on my phone. I don't know why. So I use a notebook. Also, um, sometimes I take the time to create my to-do list for the next day while I'm on the train. So yeah, it's pretty tiny and so, you know, it doesn't take much space. Then ibuprofen because I get headaches a lot all the time so I just need to have ibuprofen in ev I basically have a sheet of ibuprofen in every handbag because otherwise I just otherwise I don't have fun at all so I keep that in there then tissue 
tissues. Because you need tissues, obviously. Obvs. This is really handy. So this is my phone and my cards. Basically the bag is too small to fit a person and although I have a coin purse that I use every day, um, if I can make more room and put one less thing in there, the better. So this case is from Casemade and I've reviewed this case on my blog. I will link the blog post down below. Um, it's basically really nice and it's Italian leather. So oh, it smells really good. And I like how it looks. It's quite simple, it's elegant. It's got really nice um, red stitching all the way around. Um, so yeah, so it looks really nice, it looks really elegant and that is what I want in a phone case. So this opens up with a magnetic clasp and on one side there's the compartment where you put in your phone and it's very tight and safe and on the other side you've got three slots where you can put cards and I put my bank card, ID card and my Oyster card because that is all I'm going to need tonight. So it's pointless putting my purse in there when I can just fit everything in here. It also means that I have my most important possessions all in one compartment. So basically if I am going to leave my bag lying around, I can just keep this in my hand and I've got my bank cards and my phone in there which is basically what I really want to keep safe. Um, so I really like this and I find it so handy and it just has been saving my life when it comes to using small bags and also to make my bags lighter because I can make a bag really heavy if I wanted to and this is kind of my excuse not to because I like it so much um, so yeah I'll link the blog post down below and their website to see where I got this because they've got amazing stuff and products and what else keys which comes with a nice R keychain for Rebecca obviously um, which I got from accessorize if you're wondering and those are my keys and a pen because it's pointless having a notebook on a night out without a pen so need a pen and last but not least my power bank um, because one thing that freaks me out especially if I'm out late at night is my phone dying on me and recently my phone battery life has been so so bad that I just need my power bank all the time um, and that is it. It wasn't a long video which is good it means that I don't have a, not a lot of stuff in my handbag that is what I was going for. Um, I'm really interested to know what's the weird thing that you need to have with you regardless how small your handbag is anywhere you go um, it would be quite funny or maybe sad because I realized that I'm the only weird person if you like this video please give it a thumbs up don't forget to subscribe and i will see you very soon with a brand new video bye